You hate ads, I hate ads. You know what I like? Patreon.com slash Inkdependence keeps this channel ad free. Hello folks, welcome to Ink Dependence. I'm Mike, and this is the Pilot Custom Heritage 912 fountain pen. And this one comes with a music nib. You'll also notice this is a black resin pen with rhodium hardware, and a little sticker here, which I suggest you leave on because these pens will look very much alike if you do not leave those stickers on, and you're probably gonna wanna leave it on because you might want more than one of these. There are 15 available nib sizes and styles for this pen, and there are some really cool options here in this line. If you'd like to see some of those other nibs, check the channel. I have got these pens on loan from, from Pilot, and so I have a bunch of videos about these nibs. Also, if you'd like to know more about the Pilot Custom 912 itself, then go ahead and check out that video, which will give you a nice overview of the pen. In this video, we are focusing on the music nib. So let's take a look at this nib close up. So here we have the uh, music nib for the Custom Heritage 912, which is a number 10 size nib. That's what this 10 means. Then you have the MS for music stub. And then you have most distinctively, I think here, two nib slits on this 14 karat gold rhodium plated nib right here and here. This gives you in effect three tines. Then looking at the tipping there, you'll see that it is nice and flat across the top. It is also flat here at the front of the nib and on the bottom. And so what you end up having here is sort of a, uh, a sort of italic -y sort of nib, which will also allow you to write with just the tip of it, sort of very perpendicular to whatever your subject is, because you might be writing on an easel writing notes. So let's go ahead and take a look at how this thing writes. Here we have the Mormon Demosthenes paper with the five millimeter grid that I've been using for these writing samples. And uh, here's what this pen writes like. I can see in just like everyday regular old writing of letters and words, you do get a nice uh, amount of flow here. This pen is dipped and not filled, but that really doesn't have much effect on the flow uh, at this point. You've also got a nice bit of characteristic, uh, you know, sort of uh, uh, narrow and wide lines because of the stubby character of this nib. And when you do a vertical stroke, you can see it's quite wide while keeping your horizontal strokes very thin. So this is not really a flex nib. There are some flex music nibs out there, but that really isn't what's going on here. Although it is a little softer than the other music nibs I have. You can see this one, I put a little bit of pressure on it and it did widen the ties just a little bit, but I don't really see any benefit to that. It doesn't uh, flex enough. It's not soft enough to make a difference. And so don't lean on this nib. You're not really gonna get anything out of it. But what this is really meant for is being able to write uh, on a sort of perpendicular surface and do, I don't know, maybe some eighths or like some sixteenths or something like that. And you can just add those things in. Here's a nice whole note, whatever you wanna do for, uh, you know, music. Uh, I am <laughs> I'm not a musician writer, but I have played a lot of music and I've seen a whole bunch of music. So this is a nice thing that will allow you to do like thick and thin lines. You can get those, you know, little dash lines in there for the, uh, the 16ths or whatever, or I don't know, hell, some 30 seconds, why not, right? But you can go ahead and write music with this if you like. If not, you can just give your uh, everyday writing uh, a nice bit of character. If you like, it can keep up with some fast writing. You can write slowly with it. You can uh, do, you know, really whatever you like with this nib, but it does give you a nice amount of flow. It gives you a really nice differentiation between the verticals and horizontals, and it looks darn cool doing it. So uh, a really nice nib, a little bit more on the italic side, a little bit sharper on the edges, which gives you a nice uh, sharp line here at the edge. Uh, sharper than most of the other music nibs I've tried. Uh, and so if you are a person that will rotate your pen a little bit, uh, it feels okay, but if you rotate too much, you will feel a little bit of a corner. And that's um, that's totally fine. This is a, a feature of this nib that will give you these nice uh, sharp lines and give you a sort of exact line width that uh, I think looks really attractive. So there you go. That's the music nib for the Custom Heritage 912. And uh, until uh, another video, peace out.